sino una umami? <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> Kinakabahan ako bigla. So what's gonna happen today is tatanungin kami ng personal questions about our relationship. And we've never seen these questions because Pao actually put them together, perspective PH. And what we're gonna do, para makuha yung both sides of the story, when one person answers, the other one is wearing uh, headphones. Kasi para hindi bias. Para hindi marinig. Okay, para hindi marinig. Para, para, para hindi mag -away. Para hindi mag -away. Oh my gosh, mag away tayo pagkapanood ng video. <laughs> okay, game. So we'll hear the question first, tapos ladies first daw ang sagot. Okay. Unless ayaw ang sagutin, and then si Wancho. <laughs> ladies first, so ako mag-ahead. Mm -hmm. Okay, yay! Kanye West, K din naman yun, pwede na. Can you hear us? Huh? Huwag <laughs> nakabahan na ako. So Wancho and I actually met a while back. We met around 2014, and um, it was during an event that I had, I was hosting, and he was an artista already back then. So, what happened was, I was hosting, tapos pagkatapos ng event, lumapit siya sa akin, tapos nagpa-picture siya sa akin. Because apparently, 2013, 2014 pa lang, he had a huge crush on me na daw. And, um, so he took a photo with me, and I took a photo with, with him also, kasi ko, cute to ah. <laughs> I'm cute though. Ah. Uh, so I took a photo with him, and then after that, we never had an encounter again until I got into GMA. So. Can you hear me? No. Huh? No, oh, yeah. she can't hear me. Uh, we met before. So, it's a event, clothing event. Parang opening na isang clothing event sa Clark. April, I was, I was uh, not sure who was exactly, but it was April 20, 2014. Uh, she hosted, she hosted the, uh, the event. But before uh, me going to that event, uh, I would see her already um, on social media accounts because she was a social media personality. Na siya. And I was looking forward uh, na siya yung mag host na event pero hindi ko alam na siya so when she when she went out and she was apparently the one hosting I was really happy because I got to meet her in person and then she actually chose me uh, as one of the best dressed no uh, no araw na yon and then um, I finally got after the event I finally got the chance to approach her and ask her for a picture I was like, picture ako. Uh, I'm picture din sa sa akin. Hindi pa lang bakit. <laughs> Sabi niya, dahil matangka daw ako. Eh. Anyway, so uh, I followed her on Insta Instagram, Twitter, and she did the same thing. And then, simula ng 2014, I just, I just kept on DMing her. <laughs> Makapalkilay. <laughs> Tama. Ganda. <laughs> Tama. Oh, mo yung lips ko? <laughs> My first impression of Juancho was he was very handsome. And I remember since 2014 when he took a photo with me, we never got to see each other, right? With me rather. We never got to see each other, but he always messaged me. So every time like to slide siya sa DM ko. So he would message me no una Twitter kasi Twitter pa yung uso no. So nagte-tweet siya sa akin, hello, nakikinig siya sa radyo. Uh, Ate Joyce, I'm listening now on your show, mga ganyan. Or every year mga happy birthday siya, Merry Christmas, mga ganung weird things lang. Until I got to GMA at nag-transition na yung DMs niya into Instagram. First impression ko kay Joyce is this she is. Uh, she has. She has a very, very strong personality. Uh, strong head. Really strong head. Tama naman yung ano, yung first impression ko. <laughs> diba? <laughs> She's very strong headed, and uh, she knows what she wants. And hindi siya nagpapadikta sa ibang mga. Ano gagawin niya? I respect that. Sino ang unang 
Ako. Si Juancho, siyempre. Di ba, no love? Di ba? Di ba, no love? <laughs> Grey elephant. Ano? Kuitish? Ano kuitish? Uh, ako unang mamin. Uh, Although hindi ko naman kailangan kasing aminin, di ba? Alam niya na eh, palagi naman ako nag-DM sa kanya, you know, uh, dinadaan ko lang sa biro na halata naman na totoo. So, uh, we started out sa unang hirit, uh, nag, uh, nag-pick up lines kami uh, to each other. Tapos nagkatotoo lang, nagkatotoo lang. It just, you know, it just happened naturally. Oo, oh, kasi para ito, umpisa pa lang ng unang hirit, kinukulit niya na ako, pwede niya ako ligawan. And I kept saying, ayaw ko pa, ayaw ko, hindi ako ready, ayaw, ayaw, ayaw. So, si Wajo na. Oh my gosh! Unang date namin. Shucks, I'm gonna be so bad at this. Wajo remembers all these details. Ako yung lagi ko nakakalimutan to eh. Um, the first date, outside of work, this is what Wancho's gonna tell you. So, sabi ni Wancho sa yun ang first date namin is in backyard at the Grove, where he went to me after his work ata or something, and I was with my best friend Mika. But that's not true. That wasn't our first date. It was just the first time that we hung out. Our first date will have to be. Oh, ni ko manandaan. Oh my gosh. First love. First date? Oh my gosh, wait, easy ko to. Sorry guys. Oh my gosh, I can't remember. I don't know. In my head, our first date was when we went to Tagaytay. But I don't think that that was our first date because he said I love you not. <laughs> so, yeah. I don't know. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad at this. Love you. First date. First date. Okay, first date. Dito ako baka. Baka. <laughs> Baka dito kami hindi magtugma ni Joyce because uh, I don't know. I don't know kung ano. Wait, wait. Hindi mo rin alam no, kung kailan first date natin. Saan mo naririnig? Hindi ko naririnig. Nababasa ko yung lips mo. Saan yung First date, first date. Ha? Huwag mo saan yung I don't know yung what she considers a first date. But uh, kinoconsider ko first date. Nag-hangout lang kami. Uh, she needed someone, and uh, I traveled all the way from uh, QC to Pasi to to go to her. Cause may may she, apparently she, uh, may crisis she pinag dada. So pinagtahan ko siya sa sa restaurant December 3, 2018. And uh, yeah, we just talked. First time namin mag hangout outside the world, and. Uh, we we talked and then I brought her to my uh, friend's basketball game. And then pagkatapos na hinatid ko na siya pa. And then the next day, we had unang hiriw. And dahil uh, I, I stayed up with her uh, and uh, just was with her during that time that she needed someone. Pagka, pagkapasok namin, kinapukasan sa unang hiriw, may dala siyang tatlong klaseng kape para sa akin because she, she didn't know what I wanted. So, uh, sobrang sweet nun kasi wala, getting to know each other stage pa lang kami nun. Although, hindi pa naman kami totally leading into, into a relationship. Pero I saw how thoughtful she was. The ultimate thing that made me want to marry my partner was his set of values and beliefs, his character, and his love for God. Can you hear us? Huh? You can hear us? <laughs> um, and also his love for his family. So, in the beginning of our relationship, and I know this will sound so bad, probably, but um, in the beginning of our relationship, before I let Wancho uh, court me, I actually told him that I want to get married with the person that I'm gonna be with the next time. So if I'm gonna have a boyfriend, I want to see that person as someone that I will marry. So if he was in it to like just have fun or date around, Bowie. So if he was in it to have fun or date, ah, Bowie, stop it. Put, 
That's my dog. So if he was in it to have fun or just like date around, wag na, kasi masasayang yung oras namin parehas. So ayon, we kind of had like the idea of marriage even before going into the relationship. Moncho did say that he also wanted to get married and be with someone that he sees. Parang yun din yung parehas naming ultimate goal. Um, and we went into premarital counseling actually in church before we got engaged. So it was really like a sobrang it was really intense. Some people would say that we did all of these things so quickly. Parang we got married so quickly. But I really think that it doesn't matter how long you guys have been together. Uh, what matters is the quality of the things that you experienced during the time that we were together. So that's how I knew that I was gonna marry him. Hey, I just recently talked to my friend about this, and si Joyce kasi is the first person who accepted me for who I am, for what I have, and for what I can give in a relationship. Hindi, you know, she accepted me as a person. She loves my friends and family. First time kong nakita ng taong sobrang bilis maka-click with other people. And, you know, I love that about her. Dahil ramdam ko talaga yung genuine love niya and acceptance. Not only to me, but sa pamilya ko rin, sa mga kaibigan ko. Uh, and because of that, I'm free to just be myself around her. Free to just focus on her, not focus on me. Na, uh, alam ko na wala akong pagkukulang sa sarili ko kasi mahal na nga as is. Uh, so, it just, you know, parang mas malaya akong pasayahin siya, mas malaya akong mag-work on myself. I, I feel, I feel and I know that I'm growing with her and she's doing the same thing. Wancho's favorite food are as follows. He loves bistek Tagalog and he also loves mushroom soup. But not the mushroom soup na madaming pepper or actually tastes like real mushroom. He likes the canned ones. Favorite pastime ni Wancho is to play NBA 2K and that the Mobile Legends. But we had fought so much about Mobile Legends so he just decided to not play at all. And he also loves to play basketball. Every time we fight or every time he's stressed, that's all he does. He plays basketball in real life and also on 2K. His favorite color? Wancho does not favor a color. I would say... I would say blue or black. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Joy Spring. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm telling you, he's gonna say the same answer. <laughs> <laughs> diba? Oh, no, man. <laughs> Favorite food the Joy is a uh, salmon steak. And that me. Uh, probably writing. Writing songs. And... Hmm. Playing the piano to you. Tama ba? Tama ba? Tama? Tama na? Ha? Oo. Tama? 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 Oo. Ang alin? Teal. Maliban sa akin, siyempre pangalawa si Teal ng isko. Congrats, we made it. <laughs> you got over the hump. <laughs> five years from now, I would love to tell my husband five years from now that uh, God has been faithful in protecting our marriage and taking care of us and that I feel as loved or even more loved as I did the first day until now. Ako. Saan kulit ang anak natin na bulin mo nga? <laughs> Probably. Siyempre, kung uh, ako ang tatay nun, malamang... Oh my gosh, ko. I can't imagine. Mga tatlong ako. Hindi ko ma... Tatlong ako running Lord, around. Hindi ko kaya. Kaya mo yan. Hindi ko kaya. Ikaw pa nga lang eh. <laughs> um, sabihin ko kay Joyce, five years ko na. Kumain ka na ba? <laughs> Tagal nun ah. Oo. Oh. Um, <laughs> congratulations. Congratulations. Uh, marriage isn't uh, an easy thing. Mm -hmm. uh, 
uh, it requires a lot of work and we know naman that it will be after God our top priority. So, uh, congratulations. Galing ng Pilipino. Congratulations. Itong baby season. number para walang middle child yes hindi pa middle child hindi pa middle child so that's it for this video did you enjoy that love? I did I did enjoy this uh, senti and uh, calm video <laughs> senti and <laughs> calm video no yeah. ako pulang ganta um, we hope you guys enjoyed it also if you did please do let us know in the comment section like it share it and of course subscribe to my channel and to watch this channel thank you for watching bye bye